Um, I'm thinking. Have I seen you before? Oh, uh, yes, I think so. On the train from Blackwater, perhaps. Yeah. Yeah, you were talking with the preacher. Yes, sir, I was. I don't know if it's so safe out here, miss. Oh, Jenny. You can call me Jenny. Uh, uh, all right. Uh, I'm safe because I, I have faith. So uh, faith can move mountains. That's the whole point. You're trying to move a mountain? Oh, no. Uh, I can't do anything. But with faith... I can achieve great things. I know that. I know it. You want me to take you back into town, ma'am? You seem kind of unwell. Oh, I, I get such clarity out here. I see things purely. The world is so beautiful. And full of things that'll kill you. <laughs> including illness. Nothing's gonna kill me, sir. Well? Take care, then. <coughs> Miss Jenny. <coughs> Miss Jenny. Don't look like the Almighty's much inclined to help you out here. I was kind of worried about you, so I... Brought you some medicine. Oh, oh heavens. Oh, praise you, Lord. I knew you'd save me. <coughs> Excuse me? You see, it was only through his will that you were ordered to save me. Tell me, <coughs> were there angels in your vision? Jenny, uh, can I take you back into town? Oh, praise you, Savior. I knew you'd save me. <coughs> Will you come with me? Oh, I'm fine here, mister. I, I'm in heaven. <coughs> heaven. <coughs> Howdy, friend. I didn't know anyone lived out here. Whoa! Now you can't rob the place now, can you? Now get! Friendly old bastard, ain't you? I don't need me no friends, friend. We all need friends, old timer. We die alone, but we live among men. You know, I was interested in moving out this way with my family. Would you be willing to sell me a parcel of land? We wouldn't even have to speak or nothing. Land's too dry for farming. Bandits run all the cattle off. Why you want this land? I guess I just like the scenery. Well, I don't know. Maybe for $200 I could give you the deed to this land, find myself a place up in Blackwater. Although I never could stand the people down there. No, sir. It's a bargain at twice the price. Okay, I'll take it. Here you go, then, partner. Good luck out here. Howdy. You got the deed? Yep. Here it is. Oh, here about it is all alone. All right. Good of you to put your own money up for the deed. There you go. There's a little something extra in there for you. Always best when these transactions go smoothly. Particularly when you can make more money out of it. Hmm. Good luck with the property, McAllister. Oh, yeah. Mister! Mister! 
Some city fella just attacked me and broke my leg. What? He broke my leg. Some city fella. Guy got kind of creepy on me, and then he got violent. When? Just now. Uh, he ran off that way. Can't have gone too far. If I find him, I'll bring him back this way. Thank you, mister. <laughs> Why won't you people just let... This is a nightmare. <laughs> Don't annoy me. Take me back to that man! <laughs> oh my good lord! Please get that man away from me! Uh, uh, hey fella! Uh, <laughs> you broke this poor on. fool's oh, leg, mister! Uh, this maniac tried to eat me! We got cannibals in these here hills! Please help me! What? Please! Fella's gotta eat now. Fella's got to eat. Ah! <laughs> Save me from this freak, please! Please! <laughs> I need your help. You and every other fool around here. No, they took her. They took my love. They stole Jeff's heart and they, they took her away. What, what are you talking they, about, they friend? Took, they took my love. They took Jeff's love by them gangsters. They hide out of tumbleweed. <laughs> can you help me, partner? Partner, can you help me? <sighs> I doubt it. But if I head up that way, I'll see what I can do. Help a fella out, partner. Have a soul. <laughs>
Oh, yeah, such a sweet sugar. What you doing here, mister? I've come for you. A mercy mission. Your poor wretch of a man lost his mind. I seen him at Raskeller Fort. Uh, my man? My man's dead. Ball man shot him about a month ago. Shot him in the back, coming out of a cat house. Gave themselves medals. Just like I gave myself to that poor bastard. Unless you've been to hell, you ain't seen no man of mine. Then where is she? Who? Jeb's girl. Who's Jeb? Creepy kind of guy. Short black hair. Mustache. <laughs> oh, my, oh, my. <laughs> this is Lucy. This is Jeb's girl. You dumb fool. <sighs> Took it off him about a week ago. Hmm. Then you better come with me. <laughs> yeah. We better get her back to her man, huh? You gonna made my day. What a fine romantic you is. <laughs> well, come on, then. All right, follow me. Never have listened to that crazy fool. Mercy mission. Ha! So did Jeb offer you some kind of reward for this? No, miss. I was just helping him out. Well, ain't you the sweetest thing? I'm just like you. A real sweetheart. Come on! here strike me as being kind of funny. But Jeb, he's a special type of funny, I'd say. I'm inclined to agree with you, miss. <laughs> you good, mister. I'm glad you find it so amusing. Hey there, Lucy. You excited to go back to your special man? Miss, are you speaking of that horse? <laughs> well, Jeb sees something in her, doesn't he? You think he's gonna have flowers waiting for her? There's some things I'd rather not think about. Mister, I gotta thank you. I'm gonna remember this one for a long time. Let's go! Mister, mister, you found her, mister. Oh, I found her, all right. Come here, girl. Come to daddy. Oh, you're so beautiful. I'm so strong, yet such a lady. I long to hold you. I missed you so much. You got problems, friend. Oh, I ain't got no problems. Not now that she's back with me. Oh, I remember a cold night that we spent together. Every night's been cold without you, my sweet thing. Oh. I thought I was sick in the head. I told you he was funny, mister. Life out here does that to people. Oh. I should know. My daddy kept goats. <laughs> Excuse me, mister. Yeah, what the hell do you want? Look, 
Don't ask how, but I know what you're about to do. You don't want to do this. The hell are you talking about? You know what I'm talking about, mister. I'm just here to say I don't think you should go through with it. Your wife, she loves you. Shit, mister. I don't know who or what you are, but I guess I'm grateful. I guess you're right. I was raised better than this. Don't mention it. Go on now. Welcome to Nuevo Pariso, John. Where do I know you from? You're famous, John. You're the man who shot a bunch of banditos as soon as he turned up in this country. You're a man who decided right and wrong between a man and death, between a man and his wife. And who are you? You know, I admire you, John. I hope my boy turns out just like you. For your sake, I hope you don't. You kill people so easily, yet you respect the vows of marriage. That's very curious. I'll let the appropriate authorities judge my morality, friend. Yes, you will. And they shall. Anyway, I hear that an old nun is traveling from the monastery, taking the money she raised to the bank. Why don't you head up there and see if you can lend her a hand? Road's full of thieves. Either that or robber yourself. I'll see you around, John. I hope you don't. Many people without food. Arms for the poor! Uh, oh, sir. Could you find it in your heart to donate some money for the poor? Perhaps cast a little sunlight into their lives? Well, maybe, but ain't it the Lord's responsibility to look over his flock, not mine? Yes, but the Lord has brought you to me so you could help me. They're at their wit's end, and their faith has been cast aside. All it would take is a few dollars to get them started on the right path, so they could see there are those who care. A few dollars to completely restore someone's faith? I never knew life is so simple. There you are, sister. Yes. Life is much simpler than we make it. Gracias, señor. And God bless you. <laughs> <laughs> 